Hi, I am Ryan Cunningham with StudioWars.com, a fantasy movie league that crosses fantasy football with Hollywood. Today I'm going to be going over creating your own fantasy movie league that you can either make public to anyone to join or invite your own friends. So the first thing you want to do besides going to StudioWars.com is to go up in the upper right hand corner if you have not uh, already registered. Click on the register button and there you will enter your preferred username and your email and about five minutes and you will get a uh, password emailed back to you. If you're already a member at Studio Wars, go to the log in, enter your username and password, which uh, let me see if I can remember mine right now. Of course I can. It's usually just in the memory here. Now the uh, first page that Studio Wars then takes you to is the public leagues. This is just uh, by default and you can look at any league that you might want to join. And if you just click on these you can see a little bit of information about the leagues. If you want to join them you can click on join the league or click on uh, this link for some information where from there you can also join the league. But today we're going to be uh, creating our own league. So to create your own league go up to the members menu in the upper right hand corner and go to create a league. I like to be descriptive and uh, have a little fun with your league name. Uh, I apologize, I am not very creative, so we're just going to call this a super fun Studio Wars League. This league will be, and under the description, this is where you need to make sure to let people know what your intentions are, uh, what your start date is, when you plan on holding an auction, and how long of a league you plan on having. If they don't know these things, they're pretty reluctant to sign up for a league. So we're going to tell everyone that this league is open to anyone. First eight people to sign up. Um, the league will start the first week of December. The auction will be held on November 29th at 7 p.m. Central, and it will be a three-month league. There. Um, pretty standard, pretty boring, but we're giving the information that people need to know. Uh, one other thing that's good to add is there are multiple types of auctions, so to tell which type of auction you plan on using. And we'll go over the auction types later, but um, we will be running a live auction. So if you cannot attend the auction, please do not sign up for this lead. There we go. The next thing we see is the league's start date. And I said it's going to start the first week of December. So I'm going to go here. I'm going to do the first full week. So Monday, December 3rd. So what that does is it just starts the league on that date. And um, all the movies that we'll be releasing uh, that um, Friday will be included. The next thing is the league duration. You can do choose a two-month, three-month, four, six, or the rest of the current year. So we are going to choose a uh, three-month, I believe I said in there, yep. And then in the type of league, this is where you can either make your league public or private. If it's public, you will your league will show up on the page that we were just previously at. If it's private, it won't show up anywhere. That's actually the way most leagues are done. And then you need to go and invite your friends, family, neighbors, Facebook friends, everyone. So there you go. And then we're going to submit the league here. The next page that uh, Studio Wars is going to take us to is the League Management page. This page is only viewed by the League Admin, which is the person who created the League. Alright, this is the League Management page, and like I said, only the person who created the League is able to view this page. All other members joining will not have access to this page. Um, you'll see your League name here, and if you click that, you get 
go to your main league page. We can show you that in a little bit. The creation date is when I created it. It's public league. Currently, there is one member. And 38 movies coming out over the next three months are included in this league automatically. Uh, one thing you can do if you want, we uh, by default, you get the Studio Wars logo. If you want to put your own logo in here, that's great. Uh, this next box is the time remaining until the league starts. So our league starts in one week, one day, 22 hours, 20 minutes, and 41 seconds. Uh, the next box is the league settings. The league money is based on um, data that we've gathered of past leagues of how much money tends to be the right amount to purchase the movies at good prices and be competitive. So it's best to typically leave that alone unless you've uh, played a few times and you want to try something new and limit your money or give everyone ridiculous amounts of money, whatever you want to do. Um, the set league visibility. This is actually really handy. If you get your eight players in, um, you can then make your league private so that people can no longer see it and try to join it, which will just create problems. They'll get upset and you'll have to say, sorry. So if you want to just only have four people, once you get your four people, make it private, whatever you want to do. And then you can just change your default number of members in the league. That setting isn't quite so important. Um, the next one is distribute the starting money. This is something you only want to do once you've got all your members in the league because once you have distributed the money, it takes all of the money that you have up here for league money and divides that among all of the players in the league. So if you have four players, it will divide this, um, what is that, uh, 230 million? Is that million? Yes, it is. 230 million among all of the players. You distribute the money before you get all your players, uh, the money will be off and someone won't have any money, so that will not work. You can still invite members even if your league is public. So if I created a public league and I had one friend that was going to play with me, I can go here and invite that person. Oops, uh, excuse me. Ryan, Ryan at StudioWars.com. And then you can send them a uh, private message as well, or just leave it to our standard message here. Click the invite, and it will send an email inviting them to join your league. All right, so now we've invited some players. The league is public. And here you get to see all of the movies that are currently um, going to be available for your auction and for your league to play with. Um, if you want to see any information about these, if you click on a movie, you will go to the movie information page where you'll see a blurb about the movie, um, a link to its IMDB page, its Rotten Tomatoes page. There's the IMDB. There's the Rotten Tomatoes, uh, a preview, and then if you've already run your auction, you'll see who owns it, the purchase price, their current profit, and their return on investment, which currently no one owns it, so um, there's nothing there. But that's just a good place to start all of your research when you're getting ready for your auction. So we're going to go back here, back to the page. And uh, that's pretty much all there is. You have now created a league, and it is ready to go. The last box down here is just uh, for deleting the league. Uh, it's not something you want to do right now. So the next step is to just wait for some members to join your league. Usually a good idea to give them uh, a week to two weeks to get one of these leagues filled up. Thank you for watching.